my beloved son, my beloved self and Arpa, I bless you. Today it is uh, 12th of September 2020. Just now I have seen in uh, Sun News Tamil channel that uh, Sri Gulam Nabi Azad, uh, one of the former leaders of uh, Congress, Indira Congress party and uh, departed Congress resigning from the basic post as a member of the Congress also as he was uh, having a difference of opinion in the leadership of the Congress. Previously also I told that it is better for him not to quit the party rather he has to make the party more uh, democratic and uh, he should uh, contest the elections uh, for the party for the Supremo, Congress party Supremo. But uh, he has quit the party. Just now he told that uh, he would uh, announce his new party's name within next 10 to 15 days. So I invite Sri Gulam Nabi Azad, instead of making one more party, to join my party, New Generation Party. If he joins our party, the party will be more strengthened. And uh, in turn, he will be our uh, party's uh, prime minister candidate in the next general election, 2024 elections. He, he has the chances to become the prime minister of India. And also he told that there is no uh, uh, possibility of uh, reinstating the article 370, giving special status to Jammu and Kashmir. That also uh, will be taken care of by the new generation party, our party, if he joins our party, we will reinstate the article 370 and make the Jammu and Kashmir to enjoy the special status once again. What has been done in the present government by Narendra Modi and all against the Kashmiri's interest, the bifurcation of the state and all other things will be removed and once again the original article 370 will be reinstated in the constitution of India. This was a, a promise to the Kashmiris and the majority of uh, Islamic communities who are interested in that. Therefore, our parties, new generation parties, not for any particular community or caste, are not for any particular or religion, we are common for all. We are for Hindus, Muslims, Christians, Buddhists, Jains, and all other minority religion, religions also. There won't be the word caste and religion in the constitution once we get the power. This is our uh, first motto. So in that way, what are all good for the people who are called Muslims? What are all good for the people who are called Hindus? What are all good for the people who are called Christians and other religious names? For them, we will do good. At the same time, there won't be any discrimination or differences based on caste or religion. So I invite Sri Gulam Nabi Azad to join me and make new generation party stronger for the better India. Shift home.